The latest Nissan Navara has had some issues, mainly with its rear suspension, but Nissan has been beavering away to come up with a new model. Now it may look identical other than the colour, but beneath the skin there are some big differences. That's because Nissan has been busy revising the suspension for its latest Navara. The basic setup remains, coil springs front and rear, but Nissan has developed new dual pitch springs for the rear end. It's all about better preparing a car that's often used as a workhorse for those bigger loads. Without even driving it, you can see a huge difference between old and new. We've now got 750 kilos in the rear, and there's a lot less sag in the new one compared with the old. Now the biggest difference comes once you put a load in the back. It's so much better tied down, better controlled, and you don't get that tendency to float around and hit the, uh, the limits of the suspension travel as the previous one did. We're lucky enough to be tagging along with Nissan for what is a final sign-off drive of this latest update. It's all about validating the work that has been done over the past 12 months, tuning, tweaking and testing to ensure that the Navara does what it's supposed to. And the key here is that this testing is happening in Australia. Engineers realise that Australia not only has some unique road conditions, but also unique usage requirements from the broad range of people who buy dual cab utes. To say this car is important for Australia is an understatement. The Navara has been hammered in the sales race. You've got newcomers such as the Ford Ranger that have um, really kicked some massive goals in terms of sales. Nissan wants some of that ground back. Is this the car to do it? Well, it's certainly made a step in the right direction. Owners of a current Navara will still recognise this car when they step into it, um, but if they drive around with a big load in the back a fair bit, they're going to notice huge improvements to this one. It hasn't transformed the Navara, but it's uh, made it a far better thing, particularly if you are carrying a load. Love your car, where it be, be, where it be, Nissan, be.